Misty, the honest menace of why shall survive. Good luck, Quill. Yeah, we'll see. Multiplayer makes me super nervous. I don't, I, 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 I yeah. If you guys watch my video on YouTube, you know why. I, do, I don't like being competitive like this. I don't like what it brings out. So hopefully we can just be really friendly with a lot of our neighbors, um, help out, you know, people, and uh, just have a great, lovely, grand old time. Uh, thank you very much for the resubs that are coming in. Uh, we're going to try to do this real quick because I don't know when this game is going to start, but potentially really soon, hopefully soon. Falafel Waffle at 51 months, a Dexter Man at 12 months, Aritra Mustafi at 15 months, Prince Jordan at 6 months, a Lazy Boot at 32, Don Donny Mo at 9 months, a Silent UK at 29 months, Rhodesy at 17, the Ifrit Guy at 24, Excel Miguel at 12 months, Rat Lord at 36 months, the One Weird Kid at 25 months. I know we're going fast, but I feel I gotta hasten at 29 months. Aritra Squint at 13 months, Akiro at 54 months, uh, Turtle giving some gift subs, thank you very much for that, Turtle. Asphalt at 19 months, Sarge Dragonis at 29 months, Sobe Sky uh, at 2 months, Paul Harkonnen at 15, Jake Loans also giving some gift subs, thank you very much for that, Dram Rabbit at 60 months, Sputnik at 6 months, Salvius at 50 months, 11th Plague with a ton of gift subs, thank you very much for that, Kaysen with some gift subs, Silverfish with some gift subs, uh, Bloody Swede with some gift subs as well, uh, Icarial with gift subs, oh my god. That was incredibly amazingly cool. Uh, and just now, Rhineland Chief at 11 month resub. You bring you bring light in at 40 months. Snavia at 52. Wandering Ursa at 23. Wolf Spider at four months. Uh, and thank you very much for all that. Okay, let's open up the chat. Um, hold on, I gotta get my Discord back up. I gotta get this back up. <sighs> this is gonna be really hard. I like strategy games, but I like strategy games because you can pause them. Here, we're not going to be able to pause because it's going to be multiplayer, and I'm going to be distracted by, you know, people jumping into Discord channels and starting chats and things like that, and having to pay attention to a million different things. I'm going to be really reliant on you guys uh, and your eyeballs to keep things going. But this is going to be the world. You can see the highlighted areas where all the various players are at this time. Um, and I am way a little Savoy over here. A little hard to see because um, the Alps, the impassable terrain here, isn't colorified as anything. So, I mean, we're kind of this weird, like, little snaky boy over here in there. Uh, <laughs> hey, Essentia. Uh, and yeah, I'm I'm just super nervous. I'm just hoping, you know, have fun and, and work together with some people to do something interesting. I don't need much, you know. If we can grab a little bit of territory in the Janone trade node, just a few provinces over here, making sure we have a decent economic base. Psh, I'm going to be fine to coast on that. I'm going to be fine. Probably. I'm sure everything's going to be okay. Pravis is actually dressed to the Pope. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, no, Radio Rez, uh, who is uh, playing in Switzerland. I mean, unless unless he was lying to me and this is all some sort of like crazy con. Um, we're going to be buddy buddies. We're going to work together. Probably at some point there'll be, you know, some giant like, Catholic versus Protestant war or something like that. But I mean, that's that's entirely different. Right. Um but theoretically, we are not going to be declaring war on each other directly. Um, and we'll see what we're going to do. Shenry is trying to work with you, he said. Wait, where's Shen? Tunis. Oh, that's right. He sent a message. Um, and I hadn't responded to him yet. Done, done, done. Yeah, it'd be kind of interesting to work with Shen. I mean, we're good Catholics and all, and I don't know how appropriate that would be. Um, but that's, you know, working with people is certainly what I'm hoping for. So we'll see. Your country is a little snake. Ask the others not to snap on you. No step on snake. Uh, how are the nations selected? Uh, we get filled in a form with uh, nations we would like to play. And uh, then things were assigned afterwards. I believe Savoy was actually my first pick. I think it was the first thing in the list. I saw that it had a new mission tree and events and ideas and stuff like that. Um, and I thought the positioning was going to be kind of interesting. And I, I, I still think that's going to be the case. A little scary. Let's not lie. Things are a little scary. But I think it's going to be an interesting play country to play. In fact, um, since I've been sort of poking around at it and trying to figure out what the situation for this multiplayer game. I'm like, I really want to play a single player game. 
as Savoy. I think it's going to be super duper fun. That's another reason why, like, I'm, I'm not going to feel the itch to do Conquest stuff as Savoy. I can save that for single player. It's going to be all right. Um, the uh, Someone asked about Bavaria. Bavaria has indeed been split into itty bitty little pieces. Uh, we do have one player over here, the Solar Gamer, who I've uh, met IRL a couple of times. Really nice fella. Really nice fella. She's playing as Lanshut, which is one of the Bavarian miners. I don't know what the um, the situation is there anymore. I don't know if it's like you form it. I don't know if it's a vassal situation or whatnot, but there's going to be all of that. Uh, Uh, let me just check the chat, make sure everything's okay. No, no one has said anything in the primary chat or anything like that. I think they might just be waiting for someone. Um, Brandenburg is not readied up currently, and I don't know if there might be someone else who is uh, supposed to be joining the game. I'm not sure. Um, some settlement game, you guys know I like the colonial stuff. I like trade. Trade is one of my favorite things in U4. I really like the way the trade system works, and that ties in very much with the colonial system. As Savoy, we're not really in a good position to do any kind of early colonization because we've got a long way to go before we can get anywhere. Um, but it would be really nice if we can do it. I mean, some people said, you know, you can do no CBs against Ireland and get that. I mean, I'm not really interested in colonizing the Americas. What I would love to do, though, is it would be really swell to get some trade companies in Africa uh, or potentially more importantly, sort of on the eastern side over here, because the Gulf of Aden, I believe we could go and send the trade up to Alexandria instead of around things. And then from Alexandria, oh, you can't actually see the trade nodes um, completely in here, but I think Alexandria flows into Genoa, which is kind of where we're hoping to go. Um, oh, thank you very much for the uh, we got a level five hype train. Nice. But early game is just going to be about, you know, getting a good, solid, safe base. Um, oh, game is initializing. How much do you want to bet we get an out of sync right away? Keep in mind, uh, this is a pre-release version of the game. Standard disclaimers and whatnot. Theoretically, this is the same one that you guys are going to get access to in three days, but things could happen. Heck it, settle Australia in the 16th century. Could be, could be, could be. Mm-hmm. Well, uh, Edo's creation, it's actually interesting. As Savoy, there's actually a mission I have where I have to be allied to two people who rival each other. So I actually am going to try. I'm assuming that Austria and France are going to rival each other early on. So I'm going to try to ally both to try to complete the mission. And then obviously at some point we'll have to pick sides because someone's going to declare war on someone else. Um, but, you know. I think they said they're hoping to do a lot of it on speed three, which is kind of terrifying. So nervous. So nervous. Okay, I have an email of a few actions that, um... Uh, oh, re-hot join. So right here to... And that's not the same window, but... I'll try that again. I actually don't know how to chat. Mm -hmm. Oh, Daniel! Yeah, I was. I thought you might you might play. You, uh, I saw you in the Discord before, and I thought you might be a player in this. Yeah, I don't know how to type in this. Oh, down here. <laughs> speed three is regular speed. Omo player usually drops to speed two with the first potato PC showing up. Uh huh. I mean, we're spread out all over the world, so with lag and things like that, um, I'm, ooh, whiskey and chocolate. Uh, I don't know if speed three will be manageable. Uh, we'll see, because, yeah, we are scattered all over the place. Oh, my God, Spotnik, thank you very much. May your rolls fall gracefully. Oh, thank you. Um, guys, Navy, do we disband everything except for our light ship early on? I kind of feel like that might be the play. Um, I'm also going to save money by dropping this. I think we're not going to have our army maintenance right away. We're going to start not drilling just at the start, just to make sure we've got enough to finance a war early on. Uh, yeah, taking Genoa would be huge. The first thing I want to do, though, is I really want to take Sabluzzo because I have a mission um, for that. So I'm going to start one spy on Saluzzo, and then the other one, one spy. Yeah, well, one diplomat, one spy um, on Saluzzo, and then the rest will set up some diplomacy stuff. Escape Europe could be. I wonder if we can sell him. 
who would be um oh, i can't interact with that how do you the thing is selling always sounds really good but it's such a pain in the ass finding someone who wants to buy them like is there a good way to interact uh cool man i'm sorry we're gonna have to mostly keep the chat focused on the game because there's gonna be way too much stuff going way too quickly as much as possible friends are usually buys i mean they're both humans here Yeah, we are in an inland sea. I'll get rid of the transports anyway. Should at least get rid of the transports. You know what? I'll just trash them. F it. Done. So, build spy network and salute so. Um, I'm going to want to mess with the estates over here. I think we're going to seize land to start off with. Um, if any estates drop below 30 loyalty, they might raise up, but they won't. So I can hit that now. There we go. Um, and there's a few of these that I am going to want to run. I mean, I should just get some loving on these guys, if nothing else. Um, we could go and do religious states, and there's one of these plus one powers for each of them, but it would mean giving up a bunch of crown land, and I don't think that's what we want to do. Um, uh, probably, this just limits the max absolution, which means we'll want to get rid of it later, but for now, just boosting the, um, uh, boosting their loyalty and influence is going to be perfectly fine. Um, and should, once it unpauses an update, actually, I might have to do that. Um... No, yeah, it, it'll go up some more. Um, over here in the nobility, I'm going to be kind of okay with increasing the equilibrium for the other things and then letting them um, run their own agendas. I think that's going to be fine. So they'll give me little missions, but I think that's not going to be a problem. So we're going to go ahead and get that started. Um, we're also going to want strong duchies to reduce liberty, desire, and subjects because of a very important thing that can happen with um, Geneva, which we've got. Not to be confused with... Genova over here. Um, there's a really interesting thing you can do here, indebted to the burgers, which gives you five loans at 1% interest each. Oh, Denmark instantly abandons their lesser partner. They split off Sweden instantly. Instantly, instantly. And yeah, France is allied with Burgundy right away. Um, so... My plan is to ally with a few different people nearby. Uh, and one of them is definitely intended to be France. So I think I'm going to do that. And I'm hoping... Who's your rival? England? I'm hoping they, they uh, rival Austria because I want to be allied to Austria. And then I can do both for a thing. Bad Dane. Yeah. Yeah, Shen. I, I totally get it. Or, well, Shen's not in chat, but you guys can... Um, so let me know. I think, I think we're gonna, we're gonna send a request there. Yeah, we're gonna no CB France. That's exactly the plan. Uh, oh shit, are we in pausing? Oh, for crying out loud. Okay, well, do this. Oh fuck, I've got so many things on my to-do list. Hold on. Um, summon a Diet to get an agenda. We'll get a mission from that. Uh, you want base tax of at least five in that province, which I'm actually kind of okay with it. Navarra, the burgers, total naval size. I'm gonna do this. We'll probably do this later on. We'll do that. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, we, I want to focus military power, so I'm going to do that. Um, it's a good thing I took some notes. Um, bum, bum, bum. Uh, you're moving down here. Thank you. Interesting. Burgundy with France and everything like that, too. That's kind of okay. I'm going to send an alliance offer to Switzerland because we are going to be buddies is what we discussed. We'll see if that works out or not, but we will see. Um, done. Okay. All right. Oh, Salute so join the trade league. Um, I wonder what that's going to mean for us. That might be annoying, because I really want to take Saluzzo. Uh Fucking rivals. Uh, who are we going to rival? Um, well, we're going to rival Genoa. And I think we're going to rival Milan. Yeah, I mean, they've already rivaled me, so we're going to rival them back. That's going to be fine. 
I think the idea was to play on speed one just to get things kicked off. Papal States immediately declares war on Venice extra, after excommunicating them. Um, I need... Relationship plots. Okay, that's France and here. Um, I did talk to... Uh, uh, sorry, I can't remember who that is that was playing up here. Oh yeah, Mordred Viking. Aragon. Aragon is neutral, right? Aren't they? They're not a player. Who are you allied to? Lithuania. Interesting. Um, you know what? I think allying to one of these AIs like this is actually a good idea. Although you're rival to Castile and Venice. I don't know. Shit, that's fine. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just be friends with Mordor Viking. He's the one who invited me to this event. Let's just do that. It's gonna be great. Trade League of Venice is disbanded. That's gonna be fine. I'm gonna go and get a bunch of dudes over here and build up to that. You start on speed one to combat the billion pop to start of the game. Two to three months you go to speed three. Okay. All right. Never ally in AI. Or we could just disband it. Yeah, I guess they're going to be targeted by a player, right? You know what? Fuck it. Just get rid of it. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. If Aragorn drives me into a war with France, that would suck. I mean, I could just say no, but then I would lose the prestige, which would be really bad. Um, too few rivals still. I don't know. Um, I'm going to want to rival someone who's not a player. Oh, I should just rival Venice. Venice isn't the player, and they're going to get eaten up by a bunch of dudes. You know what? Let's just do that. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. Oh, hello. What was that? Oh, you're really quiet. Or my sound is off. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm yanked my stuff up, too. What's up? I'm going to attack the three leagues that are next to me, and they're allied to Provence. I can call you in and give you something from Provence if you want. Um, that sounds excellent. Let me bring up my army right maintenance. Now? Um, give me, like, one more month, Dick, if you can. All right, sure, yeah. Venice is a player? What? No. What? Oh, fuck. Venice, I, oh. Yeah, last time I checked, Venice wasn't a player. This is changing yeah, things. Yeah, Venice is a player now, yep. Alright, you want, you want one more month stick or are you ready? We're probably okay. Alright, I'm declaring now. I should bring my navy home. Uh, uh, oh. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not too worried about the fort maintenance because um, there wasn't going to have any units there and they, they go up automatically. Uh, I don't have a general, you're right, I forgot to pop that. The other thing I want to do is turn on this toggle for the entirety of the game, which is awesome. Uh, right, I need a general in my own territory here. Uh, let's just grab this guy, move him out, and do this. Merchant and Ragusa, where should I put him? Should I put him in, um, in uh, Champagne instead to collect trade? Um, yeah, I don't want to be excommunicated. Although, oh, it doesn't say that it will. Maybe it'll just give me an option. Fuck it, I'm just going to hit that. Good Catholic. We lost some ships, so that sucks. Oh my god, I don't like playing in real time. I don't want to make my leader into a general. Um, do they, they not have any forts? Oh, it's over there. That's why. Yeah, I tried to move the ships back earlier, but they didn't get there in time. Da, 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 da. Um, I guess I need, need access rights through France, right? I did have the go home at war ticked. Uh, I thought I did, but I also gave them a command to move here before I accepted, but they didn't get there on time. I could have delayed the war deck a little bit more, uh, which would have been the thing. Um, let's see if we can get military access through France. Fill your air. I mean, he's not good, that's true. 
Um, it would be a big prestige hit. Do we just kill off our air? Uh, maybe I'll just do that. When my air comes of age, I'll just make him a general. They get access rights? No, France is just ignoring me. You gonna talk to the Pope? Uh, I don't know. We've talked to the Pope. We got Whiskey and Chocolate coming in. Hang on. Um, yeah. They probably just don't want me to be able to go and siege down Provence itself. Oh, refuse to give us military access. Now, they might have just lost track of stuff. It's possible. Um, let's go and plunder a little. We haven't finished that already. Yeah, there's some money to be had there. Well, I don't want, I don't want Anjou itself. But it would be really nice to grab, uh, Aix over here, just for the trade power. Okay, England declared war on France. Well, I'm going to say yes. Um, England's allied to Switzerland, Castile, and Portugal. Now, are those guys joining in? Who is France at war with? Right now, only England. What? I didn't ally England. I didn't ally England. I allied Switzerland. Well, I'm going to say yes. Am I at war against Austria? Oh shit, that's awkward. Yeah, I can see Jean Jou. It's a little dangerous to get there. But that's the plan. We'll just have to watch out, make sure we don't run into any death stacks of anything. Pan European wartime. I mean, it didn't take very long. <laughs> oh. I will note, I have not started a war yet. It might be a short multiplayer game. That is that is very true. So what I love, by the way, uh, here, this um, raised war tax is now a toggle, two per month while at war. And you can just toggle it on like at the start of the game, literally. Peace or war, whatever. It just, the toggle stays on. It only charges you during war times, but holy crap. Is that ever going to save me like a ton of money from all the times I forget to trigger the, the shit? We're only speed one right now. You don't start wars, you end them. I mean, it's kind of true. That's sort of how it goes in Civ. Uh, and it's how it goes in a lot of this a lot of the time, too. Um, let's go back to improved relations over here. I'm going to want to be able to annex this ASAP. It's supposed to be friendly multiplayer. I know. Well, I mean, the war against, like, England and France war is basically a guarantee, right? Yeah, so we're going to do this, which is kind of annoying rather than set up a march. Had a, we had a discussion about it. We're going to do this. Placate local rulers. I'm also going to go and... Oh, I already have the strong duchies. So, yeah, we're hoping... Let me do this. Hoping that we can uh, keep Geneva okay. Smart's going to technically Danish. Okay, um, I'm going to go and do Anjou first. First year in Europe is on fire. Yeah. Uh, I was going to say, I, I may have been able to avoid a river cross crossing if I went to Bapua 2 first, which is what I should have done. Am I seriously going to lose this battle? I know I got the minus one from the river crossing, but come on, give me a break. There we go. 
What the hell? All right. Uh, where did the English army go? I've got these guys on support, right? Yeah. So they should theoretically hang around where I am. Uh, there is an Observer stream. It's not by Paradox. This is not an official Paradox stream. I don't like that I'm being um, attrition here. You know what? Let me consolidate these guys. Oh, is he, is he leaving with his troops? Oh, yeah. Okay. Good. My network is not right. We need 30 because he's in the HRE. We need 30 to fabricate a claim. It's 50% extra cost. Yeah, I, I had noticed the river, but too late. Um, by the time I realized there was a river crossing here, um, I think I was already locked or or thereabouts. I, this real time shit is not going to work out for me. Austria's starting to move in here. I mean, Austria is certainly interested in weakening France. Like, I don't think any of that matters, but that's sort of where I am at. You know, something like that would be nice to see. Uh, oh, I got a message from Shen. Okay. And then I got to get this chat window back up. Oh, I'm going to be so distracted by trying to manage chat at the same time. Okay, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to split the stack. Uh, and I'm going to pull one out. Because I don't think there's... Oh! But again, thank you. I don't think there's too much of a threat, so I'm just going to try to bring down the attrition a little bit. Um, yeah, you're right. It would be nice to do, you know, theoretically over here. Oh, more allies, but... Okay. Uh, you're right. We could spy over there. What, what, what we'll do, as soon as this hits 30, we'll set this up, and then... I, I don't think we're going to get enough spy here to really make it make a difference. You essentially be a diplomat for you. Honestly, I need a whole group. Oh, we got a pause by uh, Midgeman is the host, is the observer. Uh, that's a good point. Um, who is France? Can you send a whisper in here to someone? Lucas, that's right. That's Sardinia, right? I don't think it, there's going to be room for it in this war, but I should at least, you know, mention that it would be sweet. Oh, you can start a new chat with the invite player name. Oh, right, I've seen the group chats before. Yeah, that is cool. <clears throat> Um, I'll lose Diplo rather than Admin. Oh my god, you know what we never did? Is we never raised our stability. Take care of that right away. Yeah, we could voice chat with some people. Uh, technically, I'm in the same voice chat right now as, um, as Switzerland. Eastern Europe right now is... Tunis and Muscovy, which I'm not really going to be involved in. We could join the HRE chat channel, which actually might be a good idea. I'll wait until after this. Oh, Provence has another fort in Verdun. Wait, what? Oh, is that Provence? Oh, it is, too. Uh, Salento. So our vassals at the start are Montferrat and Geneva, and that's it. And we want Saluzzo. Oh, we're at 30, so now I can fabricate the claim on Saluzzo. I can stop building a spy network. Uh, I said, stop building a spy network? Okay. 
Maybe I hit it twice. B2 is up. Out of curiosity, what would happen right now? Oh, okay. A war with the Emperor, which I don't want to be! That's a long siege over here of the three leagues. Um, Spongenos probably... Oh, no, actually, what I need to do is um, I need to improve relations with this vassal here. I didn't actually see that pop up. What did that say? Um, Lubeck declared war on... Okay. Summon. Yeah, I don't actually want to be in a war against Austria. That's not thematically what I'm going for. And I'm not, really. I just, you know, got called in. Um, I might be able to. That's interesting, actually. I mean, but like, hey, England. Uh, I'll wait, because right now it's giving me access rights. I don't know if France will care. Um, that much. Ah, uh, maybe. There's some fighting going on over there. They're busy sieging. I could help them siege something English and then leave. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. I can't reach if we're done. So yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna peace out. And if there is some actual fighting going on here against England, I I would I would jump in. I'd feel a lot more awkward if it was Austria's troops. So many wars. I guess I can uh, siege down Bordeaux while I'm here. Cologne declares war on Berg. Well, there's that. Now, luckily, I'm still making positive money. Actually, surprisingly lots. Now, I don't have an advisor right now. But I think that's going to have to be okay. Oh, Austria is in the war against Venice. Oh, part of the uh, the Papal War. Okay. No, uh, uh, there's a bunch of Austrian dudes up here, though. So I actually don't know if they're too interested over there. Do the base tax thingy. Um, You mean spend admin on developing a province right now? I mean, there's definitely going to be some of that. What was that bong for? Is it in the new year? I think I want the war taxes, though, for just cash money. Um... Let me move here. Let's see. Or, hold on. Can I still get money? Oops. There's still money to be gotten, right? Which I will get. Yeah. Let's sit there. Oh, it's a religious screen makes the bong. Yeah, okay. I have heard it, but, like, right in the moment, I'm like, I'm panicking, right? Because it's like, there's no time to think about anything, so I'm just like, uh... What was that? Oh my god, freaking out a little. Switzerland still sieging over there. Oh. Yes, sir. What's who's that? This is uh, Holland. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was trying to figure out what chat I should go into, if any. Um, we've got both Burgundy and France in one of the chats above, but they're currently speaking Polish, so it's. Not <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not going to help me very much. No. Uh, how's capital it going up there? Sieged. Yeah. Uh, um, yeah, except for the capital being sieged and my about to have to take loans, which sucks at the start. Yeah, well, it does suck that, like, this all fell in and Austria went in against you know, the uh, the French side, which makes sense for Austria. Mm -hmm. But uh, Here's a why, real quick. Uh, from, what do you want from Provence? Um, uh, probably Toulon and Aix. Aix has got a, a, a natural harbor, which would be nice to have. I mean, All right, let me see if they will give it. I mean, as much as can get without coalitions or bullshit like that. <laughs> but All right, so I don't think I can give you both Toulon and Axe, so I can I'll just give you Toulon. Yeah, Axe is worth more, but Toulon is adjacent, so let's just do Toulon. Yeah, so um, if can you, you do both Toulon and Axe? If you do both Toulon and Axe, what? Uh, that's eighty-six war score, so that's a lot. Yeah. Um, what if uh, what about uh, four Calquier? If you do Toulon and Fourcartier, the other one. 
Because it's a lot. Uh, so, so, if you can, so if you're still sieging down, then I can wait and see what happens, I guess. Nah, you know what? Um, well, it's 100? We might be able to get uh, it. I am... uh, minus 100, yeah. I am sieging down another fort, but it will take a little while. Yeah, it will take a little... And even sieging down that fort won't be enough. I don't yeah. think one fort will give you 100, right? You know, I'm fine with just two now. Just... You know, I'm, I'm right, here to be a pacifist. Exactly. We are supposed to play tall and roll and stuff. Mm-hmm. Stop being greedy. <laughs> I actually sank two of her British ships. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start pulling my troops back. Oh, no, you abandoned the sea. Oh. Uh, I thought... If you go on it, we, we can get, like, 50 ducats more, I think. Hold on. Yeah, just... Just by standing on it? Even without war score? Yep. yep. Alright, I'm piecing out our probe. Thanks for your help. I can't get out. Apparently naval retreats have changed. Okay, you can't just retreat anymore. Well. Okay. Alright, so chat, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to try to white piece out from England. Um, so that I can start my own war. Well, I don't know if, if the uh, uh, French player is okay with that, but, you know, the important thing is for the greater glory of the Empire, right? So, I'm just saying, England, I would like to white peace with you and just not be involved anymore, correct? Because I don't want to be in a war against the Empire. Excellent. Because then, theoretically, I can declare war over here. Genoa and Luca would jump in. He just peaced out. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what I was going to talk to him about. That uh, let's not fight, let's not take promises from each other. Let's just be, you know, just fight the war and not each other. But that's that works as well. Yeah, sure. Um, fuck, I need time to think. Can I declare this war? Genoa and Luca for Saluzzo? Yeah, probably. Oh, okay, good. We've got a moment to talk. Um, now the ledger is locked. Oh, I can't access it. Well, I'm out of the war, so it doesn't matter right now. <laughs> Turn up Discord. Um, okay, so what I can do is I can raise volumes in general. And you guys let me know how the balance works out. Just shaking. <laughs> oh, sell too long to France because France is going to want it? Maybe. Uh, let me see what chat window this is in. Oh, can you see enemy strength in the declare war? Oh, question marks. Yeah, we don't have the ledger information. Um, where's Luca? Over there. They're all pretty small. I'll, I'll get the troops in, and I think we'll probably go.
Yeah, I mean, we could start with Genoa. I want Salute so we have a mission specifically for it. Um... Are they still warring? They're still warring. I should have asked to go into the war again. Yeah, I, I think we will take the morale guy. Um, we could take a bunch of cheap loans earlier as well. And drill a little as well. Oh yeah, you're right. I actually do like that. Human players. Oh, hold on. I don't want to drill because it's going to reset my morale, right? I forgot about that. Okay. These guys are almost loyal again. Austrian Pope planning to kill you? Oh, we'll keep the calves around for a second, then we'll go. Oh, you over here. Um, no, we'll keep you parked for now for this war. Race to get air? Yeah! <laughs> well, there's air, sure, and then there's air down here. That would be the ultimate get. Maybe that's what our goal should be. Ah, uh, you're right. I could set desires now. A little micro lag is weird, you know, with multiplayer. When you're used to playing local and everything is instantaneous. Okay, they have 11k. So I think the idea is I'm going to declare here. Oh my god, it's going to kill my heir. And give me a church. I feel like we might just be able to take it as is. Oh, I don't know. Does Luca have any allies? Like, we could declare on him directly. Just Genoa, which would be nice. And Genoa's allied to a bunch of people, so that's no good. Um, yeah. Hey, Switzerland. You lose this war? Well, yeah, because I fucked up. Or maybe you... We can have uh, to call back Spain. No, Spain can't rejoin. Yeah, he's got a uh, okay. he's got a truce in, now. In what way would you want to lose the war then? Like... Uh, mono reparation, probably. Yeah. Okay. No one's listening to anything. <clears throat> Actually, what I should do is put it in the main chat. Bubble chat's fine. Oh, I guess I could whisper here. I forgot that... I, can't, I can never remember this little thing. Fuck, I hate that you can't interact with anything while the game is paused like this, like, I want to be able to look at shit. I know this wasn't a whisper. I forgot that you could whisper down here, but I tried Discord and it wouldn't hear me. Okay, there we go. Uh, declare war. All in Switzerland. Uh. We go. We're gonna bop this three stack right away and then turn around. Is gonna be the idea. We do have the morale of armies, dude, which is great. Provost wants to talk to you, but listed as AFK. 
Yeah, no, just come into the AFK channel. It's fine. Like, I don't have another channel I can just sit in. Uh, what chat is he in? Uh, is he in the HRE one? Oh, yeah. Hello. Uh, Provis, you want to talk to me? Who? What? My chat is saying oh, that Will. you want to talk hey. to me. Yeah. And yeah, feel free to hop into the AFK channel. It's just, I, I'm mostly just doing it so that there's not too much noise in the chat. I understand that. So uh, I've been hearing some rumors that uh, you are worried that I am coming for you. I, there were certain things that were expressed from you in, in the pregame banter that made me worried that you were maybe going to be aggressive. Oh, no, I want to see you form Sardinia Piedmont. I think that'd be kind of fun. Well, then, like to... Good. that sounds great because I'm, I'm perfectly fine with uh, seeing what we can do to get to embiggen the Holy See. You know, since yeah. I do intend to be a devout and proud Catholic throughout all this. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Good to hear that. Um, I will say the missions I have probably put me in conflict with yours. So I was thinking maybe it'd be worth trying to figure out uh, what you're going for, what I should go for and try to partition. Like, I don't know what your missions are as Savoy. Um, well, what, I, what do you I, need to accomplish? I mean, I have a bunch to like, you know, beat up Switzerland and things like that, which I have no interest in doing. Um, yeah. But mostly, I need to get Saluzzo here for a mission, and then that's sure. pretty much it. I hope I don't lose this battle. Oh, he's got a much better general. So from uh, from there, you're just going to be building up tall? You don't want Milan or anything? Uh, I would like more Genoan trade node as much as possible, yes. Oh, well, fair. Yeah. I'm, okay. I'm hoping to get, you know, at least at least four or five things. Short-term at Saluzzo. Forming Saluzzo would be really nice. Mm -hmm. I should have yeah. waited for Switzerland. Wherever you go, I'll follow. Do you need me to move to... Oh, no, we're good now. Okay. Yeah, so you got a few things. You want to take Genoa and such, I'm sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think that's probably fine. Um, now, long-term, one of the goals that I've got, and I may or may not be able to do this. This is purely, like, if I can, it'd be all. Uh, is the formation of the Kingdom of God. I yeah, think that's fun. what I thought. But that is extremely aggressive so if push comes to shove we might be able to kind of peacefully figure some stuff out if you're willing to like give up some provinces for a tag switch and then i hand them back like i'm open to that i don't want to be aggressive i'm not a super competitive person there but uh that'd be a fun thing to do just so you know where i'm, I'm trying to go yeah no um something like that can probably be worked out yeah okay then yeah i mean as long as we can work things out i think i think you and i are gonna be fine nothing to worry about on my end well let's kill these italians yeah by the way, what was that early alliance with uh, France? Are you sticking with them, or was that just a mission I, thing as well? I do have a mission where I have to ally two people who are rival to each other. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's so a weird I'm going to try to work that out. Yeah, it's like this diplomatic thing. Huh, okay. Well, if you at any point need any help from me, or maybe some indulgences or something like that, you know, always reach out. Mm -hmm. I'm, uh, I like good diplomacy. And then I'm just going to keep chugging along at uh, Northern Italy. And uh, if we have anything that needs to get disputed or you want something, uh, just let me know and we'll we'll talk. Oh, my God. I can't fight in real time, especially not when I'm having a conversation. I, If I can't pause, yes. I don't know how this to This is fight. my plan <laughs> to distract you. Uh-huh. Yo, Quill, we need to, like, recover our morale, a little bit of manpower, yep. and then go in again. Yep. Well, that's what I was going to do. And then you came and you said, let's go get him. I'm like, all right, I guess I'll jump in. They'll probably I win the siege, but that's going to have to be okay. <laughs> I'm going to go sit yeah. in a mountain territory for a bit here. Okay. I can't merge these guys with the mercenaries. That's interesting. Yeah, that's a new change. Mercenaries have to stay independent with their own leader. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait, and these guys don't have a leader. That's true, too. You're doing the local force, I assume? Yeah, there you go. Now I yep. actually have a decent one. Oh, another question I actually have for you, Quill. Mm -hmm. uh, what is the status of your relationship with Switzerland? Have you guys decided to pre-bury the hatchet? Yeah, we, that something we're, that we're, we're hoping to be buddy-buddy. Yeah. Oh, okay. We'll be buddy-buddy. Um, I have three cores on him. I'll abandon two cores, and one of the ones we'll decide later. And uh, we are thinking of splitting Milan a little bit, and that's yeah. about it. Cool. Okay, so you guys are going to be buds. Perfect. Mm -hmm. I just want to get enough land so that I'm financially stable. And then, why, why is there an attack message over here? Oh, Aragon and Switzerland. Oh, oh. I can't that's help with that. War. Nope. 
But yeah, I just want to have enough so that my economy is okay, and then, you know, play trade, and... Savoy's so actually got a really bunch of cool uh, diplomatic shit that goes on with it, and that would be fun mm -hmm. to see. Yeah, I look forward to seeing it. I did see you uh, decided not to make Geneva into a march. Yeah. Because I have a mission to integrate them, and I thought it'd be better for my economy. Oh. If Switzerland well, yeah. had not been, like, was not going to be a bro, then... Um, I think I would have uh, made it into a march. Makes perfect sense to me. Uh, so Quill, I just lost uh, my army to the other war and uh, because I wasn't paying attention <laughs> and I was looking at Pat. So yeah. I'll be back in a bit. Yeah, re real-time warfare is uh, is proving to be our bane here. Ah, oh, fuck, I was hoping yeah. to win that battle before these guys jumped in. Yep. All right, we'll try to do a we'll try to do a solid uh, rebuild then. There we go. Muted Discord again. I mean, we have a bunch of marks. We do still have a bunch oh, of marks. Oh, as money. a heads up, Quill. Um, you may get a notice that I have claims on you. Um, that's one of my missions. Once I finish off taking Bolognese and Ferrara, uh, I get permanent claims on Tuscany, Genoa, and Piedmont. Okay. So you'll see that, but, I mean, again, nothing I can do with it. Right, right. It's just there. Just giving you a heads up. I don't know if we can jump on these. There's no one else nearby. Two to one. It's a hill attack. Oh, 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 shit. Uh... Well, that's not going to be helpful. Oh, they're locked in here, and I'm first. Oh, that's awesome. Never mind, because now I'm defending in the mountains. Mute Discord again, so I don't spam their shit. Okay. Well, that's something, at least. Now, there's a fort here, so they will get the, the fort penalty, um, the, the woods penalty. I don't know if... Would we get, get a river crossing still, and is there a way to avoid it? Actually, this angle probably avoids it. Switzerland's out. Ooh. Feeling a little bit, uh, feeling the heat there, Rez? Oh, wait, where'd he go? Oh, there you are. All right, sortie's another button we can do. Saw you, uh, peace out with France there. Doing all right? Yep. Uh, I just lost all my army, so I'm just rebuilding. What? Why is this moving? What? No! I was... Oh, I forgot I had it queued up. Fucking hell. Where's the sortie button? Okay. I thought I was, I thought I was moving here. That worked out. Uh, stack wipe. Ooh, Bohemia and Saxony are at each other's throats. Oh, there's a fort here. That's gonna be fun. My heart is just pounding. Like, I'm gonna have a heart attack playing this game. This is why I don't multiplayer, you guys. Is the stress of other human beings, but also the real timeness? Fucking hell. Now that's our war goal here. Ah, oh, we can't catch him. And France and England are at peace? Yep. Yes, they are. Well, it'll be interesting to see where that develops next. 
Yeah, I'm kind of scared of the whole France Burgundy thing. So, yeah, that was pretty bad. Uh, long story short, Loris dis disconnected and uh, France white pieced him because he didn't realize that it oh. was the AI, or the AI sent a white piece offer and he accepted it and he didn't realize no, that it was stupid. Yeah, I've seen this. That sucks. Uh, yeah, and, works. and so he was like, okay, well, let's, uh, let's cut Burgundy then. And then we did but then it was it was still felt like it was super one-sided. Yeah, okay. France strong right now with the Vassal Swarm. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, man. I even have better morale than them and it just didn't go too far. France is super strong, I agree. Too strong. Please nerf. You see what they're doing to Saxony? Granada. Yeah, I saw that feedback's in a lot of trouble. I saw that Saxony was voting for himself, so I don't feel bad. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. So was Trier. You clicked the button. Yeah, I was gonna so say, well, Ultra Hill and oh, feedback decided to try careful and Careful Switzerland. Phone. I there's mountains. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I was gonna say you had a pretty good numbers advantage, but the mountains can be tricky, and I didn't want to leave my siege. I'm enforcing peace on Trier. Oh, don't even... as a little, you know. So how you doing? Join their side. No, to beat up on him. Hey, uh, Neapolitan Chew succession. Chewy. Oh make no! Friends with, make friends with Naples, and then you'll join. What's the up, Empire. Mitch? I didn't get the. Um, I, was I didn't just get about the pop up. Hey, would you would you like to join me in the commentary box? Um, I want to ask you some questions. Absolutely. Before you do, enforce peace. Love that. Hey, man. I either get a vote or I don't get a vote. I'll vote for you. Done. All right. Then you can you can you can join. You can deny it, and I'll white piece you. Okay, I guess. <laughs> hey man, that's fair. It's fair, man. You had the cards. You played them. <laughs> I gotta respect it. Appreciate your support, and I will gladly support you in your future endeavors, my prince. Thank you kindly. All right. Okay, I'm coming, Midge. Let's do this. Where Where do we go here? Right sauce. Whew. What the heck? Oh, here you. Yeah. F for feedback. Yeah. <clears throat> that's boring. So the big question so here, I got we'll... unlucky here. Um, so when the king of Aragon dies and you have that event um, where Naples, I'm just going to move to AFK first again. A sec. Um, uh, the problem will be aggressive expansion in terms of how much I can take from Genoa, um, if any at all. Because so we got to leave a little bit of a window for Saluzzo. Um, I don't think I can vassalize Genoa. I think they're too big. Um, because they do have some lands other places, and they weren't the primary. They're not my war target. So I don't think I can vassalize Genoa. I might just have to settle for a crap ton of just money. Especially since, you know, we're going to have some more debt here. Um, yes, there's no reason to save this. No, I don't want to put this is war taxes. We also need the money. Um, we're going to take a military power. I mean, I know we need the military power, so maybe pausing war taxes there makes sense. Yeah, transferring trade power might count for a lot. We are at 195, although part of it is because we've got a shared war. So let me do this because I want to make sure I want to start integrating you immediately after the war. Um, Epic. <laughs> I'm taking. I'm considering taking Salento just so I can jump in and grab some of that Greek land. Oh, that is. That's beautiful. I love it. I want to see. I was telling buddy mine. I was like, the Epirus is the new Byzantium. Like, take Byzantium. It's even harder. Then you have to take. Oh yeah. Get rid of you know, Take Epirus. Take Byzantium. Then take on the Ottomans. There was one test game I did where the Ottomans. Uh... Guaranteed me. So I think it's a bit much to ask for that one. Nice. Oh, you just test the gaming test opportunity. Is that, you just died? Saxony is down to, to one province. Three provinces. 
Switzerland, just FYI. I don't think I'm going to be able to give you any land in this, but I'm going to ask for a bunch of money, so you should get some of that. Oh, he's muted. Never mind. Yes. And... Trier... Nassau's... I thought Nassau <clears> was going to be 